Hello everyone and welcome to another stamina video. Well, eventually. See, uh, this is a uh, older video actually, so I'm, I, I still haven't played because I'm still giving my body a break because things still feeling kind of stiff. So I was like, okay, let's go through the video archives and see what stuff I've wanted to upload but haven't commentated. And here we are, Love is War from the 2017 In the Groove World Championship pack. Yeah, I got this pack as practice and fun as well. So here we are. We're going to start with some nice slow stuff. And uh, you're going to notice that my technique is uh, not the way it is today. <laughs> and that's today's topic here. Is looking back on your stuff and going like, whoa. Whoa, what can I learn from that? Well, if you would, if you were to compare this towards my later videos, especially on the faster spots, you're going to see that I'm going to use a whole lot more energy than I do now because of very bad technique. As a matter of fact, you can probably hear me stomping pretty hard in general, but just wait until we get to the fast stuff. Now watch how much I lean back on the bar for this. Look at, look at the posture change, and <laughs> that is not good. Because <laughs> you see, the further you lean back, the more it's like that your legs have leverage over your lifting them. It's like when you're sitting on a chair, and then you lift your legs out straight and erect, and then what happens is that they just kind of get tired like that, as they're kind of drooping, because the uh, gravity is not, not your friend. And that, that's what happens when you lean too far back on the bar like I'm doing there now. Uh, but I am pleased with this score, however. I, I think the reason why it turned out well was because this was the point where I was, I was doing fast BPMs, but I could only do them in short, sustained times. Like you see, these are all just like really, really short bursts of streams here, you know, 30.33 notes per second. Well, most of the time, I should say. There's a couple 16s in there of, of measures, but you get what I mean here, and that it's it's still handleable for me because uh, I, I'm using too much energy, and these wide breaks are very useful for me to get back on track. And at the time, I had no idea why I I was having so much trouble with this when I could see other people not having that much trouble with this, you know, this sort of thing. But it's because of technique. When you're stomping this hard, when you're leaning back that far, and your yeah, your legs have that much gravity leverage against them, especially when reaching over for the up arrow. And I'm also having very wide leg movements and everything like that. It's just, it's just disastrous. Even though the score is fairly decent. <laughs> but what I mean is that this sort of technique, not really going to cut it for the even hard, harder stuff. I was just saying it's hard stuff, but the, I mean it's all hard stuff, but I mean even harder than this stuff because it's just gonna gonna burn you out of energy, probably. Unless you've got some sort of special technique that flailing around wildly is not using too much energy. Though I don't know how that would work. If it does work for you, I would like you to explain it to me because I would be I'm very confused. <laughs> and I did notice that when I'm in these slower portions like this, I'm doing a more regular technique, although I'm I am stepping a little harder than I do nowadays, in that I'm more vertical in how I'm standing, so I'm uh, having a much easier time recovering energy. But when it, when these bigger streams of fastness comes, it just goes downhill in my technique. And <laughs> This, this, this look at the posture change compared to from before, it's just crazy! <laughs> but as I said, I do make it through, and I do get a pretty good score, so I'm uploading this anyway. But, you know, it's just something to look back on and say, hey, yeah, yeah this, is, this is how far you've come, self. And also to others of that, it, it's like... You know, when you see a gradual progression of improvement, you may not notice the change until you look back at something older like this. So I'll take a look at your older Ooh. stuff and see how you are. I'm surprised I kept up so well. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you later. Hope you enjoyed too.